And we back! Today's video is inspired by something I saw in the KOT for Q subreddit, and it's from the real Evan Howe. Hell, how I don't, I don't even really know. It's called the same letter rebuild. He had a dope idea himself, but y'all know sometimes I see these ideas and I try to put my own little spin to it. So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna have a wheel with all twenty-six uh, alphabet letters on it. How many letters are in the alphabet? Yes, yes. 26, oh my God, I'm so good at this. And whatever letter we land on, we're gonna have to build a team only using that letter. And I don't wanna pigeonhole us too much, so if we land on B, we can get Brandon Ingram and Jalen Brown because either their first name or their last name has to have that letter. And this video will not end until we win the championship. If year number one, we get B and we build a team that's not good enough to make the championship, then we respin in year number two, we might get D. And we year number three, we might get Y, which I don't know what we do at that point but we're gonna keep spinning until we build the same letter NBA champion. Leave a like, subscribe if you are new, let's get that spin going. So there's gonna be some letters on here that obviously don't have NBA players like Q. We got Quentin Grimes, but like he's not gonna win a championship by himself. So if we land on one of those letters, we are gonna respin it because I'm already letting you know that we can't do it. All right, spin number one, year number one, we're getting the letter, don't tell me we land. Okay, we're not landing on Q, but instead we have N. Um, um, Norris Cole, first name that came to, I don't know. These alphabet videos suck because I'm so bad with letters and words. Okay, so there's only 16 potential players to pick from when it comes to last name. And the best person here is like Yusuf Nurkic. Now we got to go by first name because maybe there's somebody I'm not thinking of. Okay, like 99% of the websites that I went to had just all last names. This is the only thing I can find with, with first names. And this bunch of players, all of these guys are retired. We got Nicholas Batum. Nikola Jokic. Oh, wait. Oh, snap. And might not be too bad. Nikola Vucevic. Oh, snap. And Okay, let's get it. I said that like I had a choice. I, I just really, I really don't. We it, Like, we might not win a championship this year. We might be thinking about next year's spin. But regardless, we're going with the Portland Trailblazers to start off this video. I need a top pick. Please give me a top pick. Trailblazers, Trailblazers, Trailblazers. How are we going to get Jokic with the 18th overall pick? I don't even know if that's possible. It's not. I mean, I'm talking about I don't know if it's possible. Can, what, can we put together a trade? I mean, the 18th overall pick, it, to get Jokic, we better get a superstar young player. Okay, so we got Dame. We got Rob Williams. Okay, okay. Uh, not too bad. So we want to go like this. So like Nikola Jokic is, is priority number one, obviously. I don't know if we'll be able to do it. But we are going down this line, Vucevic, okay? We're going down this line, and we are not seeing a lot of ends. You got Nurkic. All of these guys are centers, though. How are we going to run them all? How are we going to trade for them all? Norman Powell. Okay, that's not too bad. All right, it's, it's not a lot out there. We have to focus on Jokic. We have to. If we want any chance of winning the championship this season, we need to get Nikola Jokic on our team. He plays for the Memphis Grizzlies, and as you know, in these worlds, we do not play with any untouchables. So anybody is gettable if you got the right package. If I throw them Dame, they're obviously going to say, no, who's our young player? We got Isaiah Jackson. Actually, Devin Vassell and Isaiah Jackson should be... Isaiah Jackson on two-star value. Okay. All right, we got some young pieces worth a little some some. You could give us back Gary Clark, who ain't worth nothing. We willing to also give you... Um, Robert Williams, who's three-star value. You got to make up eight mil. Do you got that? Oh, there's six. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. A first. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Two firsts. There's, there's something to be done here. There's something to be done here. 100% there's something to be done. Hold on. We got it. Let's restart. Starting off with just Dame and Jokic, okay? Jordan Poole, two and a half star. Robert Williams, three star. You give us back your worst play. Actually, just give us back Jared... Culver, because he's expensive for you and he's not good. One first rounder, two first rounders, three first rounders. Nikola Jokic, welcome to the team. I think there's something to do here. I, I think that we might be able to have to, you know, level up a little bit, trade Jordan Poole and Matt Struss, um, or, or Jordan Poole and Isaiah Jackson in the first to get a, a young star. Not necessarily a young star, but 85 overall Clint Capella. You know, you giving up a center, but guess what? I'm giving you a center right back. Let's go talk to the Grays again. You know, his his contract makes it maybe a little bit more difficult. They got to make up 18 million. So actually it makes it really difficult. Why is Wiggins' contract so big, bro? Why did you get... Oh, they still got to make up $4 million. So maybe that, that trade wasn't the move. And they still don't have it. Okay. Tyrese Halliburton is two overalls lower. We gave him a first round pick in that. 
but he's young on a rookie deal. He's young on a rookie deal, potential superstar. We've had simulations where he won MVP before. Look at the value. Look at the value. I'm also willing to give you um, Max Struss. Or do you want Darius Baisley? They're, they're both two-star value. Okay, they're both two-star value. Again, you give us back like Jared Culver. We don't really have any any a lot of picks anymore. One and a half star pick, that's not great. One and a half star pick, that's not great. Come on, man. Come on, Jokic. I still believe this is a possibility, y'all. I still believe this is a possibility. I gotta trade like Max Struss for like a I always I don't know if it's Struess or Struss. I've heard it both ways. There's two first round picks right there. That's a W. I'm gonna go back. <laughs> we gonna keep blowing up the phone to the Grizzlies, bro, until we got a deal. So it's Dame, it's Tyrese. It's Robert Williams. They got to make up $7 million. That's what Jericho comes in. And this is where we throw them the Suns pick. That ain't valuable. And then we give them this other Suns pick that's not valuable. We also give them our pick that's going to be valuable. It's not. I will not rest until we have him on the team. I might trade 90 overall Damian Lillard for somebody that's like a 92. Anthony Davis type. We're trading Dame, Robert Williams, and Darius Baisley for Anthony Davis. I said we were going to get a player like AD and we actually got AD. Is that a better trade for them? We're about to find out as we offered the 12th trade of the video to them. They're both maxed out value. Tyrese Halliburton. We, they got to give us back a player because we don't have a room. Jer Cover. And then now we still have this pick. We just maximize all these picks. There's two. Here's three. Here's four first round picks. They still say no. I'm thinking about it, bro. I'm doing all of this rebuild for this end team. The team is not going to be good outside of Jokic, but I, I just got my mind set on us getting Jokic and I, I don't like to fail. And if I don't get Jokic, then in my mind, I have failed. This is a good trade. This is a good trade. We got two more players. We got two more players on rookie deals. So don't talk to me about the contracts working. And now we got picks. Three first rounders. If this don't get it done, this might be the most untouchable player in the history of basketball. Oh my God. I didn't want to give up. I didn't want to give up Tyler Hero here too. You stop it. Stop it. Are you kidding me? Stop it. Stop it. Oh my God. Oh my God. We just gave up the mother load of assets. Anthony Davis, Darius Garland, Tyler Hero, and three first round picks. What? Vuce, getting Vucevic is easy. Um, Jokic is going to run the three. I mean, <laughs> not, hold, on, not, hold on, not the three. Um, Jokic is going to run the four, okay? He's going to run the four. Hey, we be living in a crazy timeline if I put Jokic at the three, low key. All right, Jokic is at the three. I mean, at the four. I did it again. Jokic is at the four. We got to go get Norman Powell, who plays for the Heat. We're going to have to give up John Collins in this trade. Okay, great. Um, so we have three in names. I'm going back to my list. Who are some other players with the last name in? Larry Nance, Jalen Noel, Frank Nilakina, Yusuf Nurkic. That's a that's a really, really bad. Ob objectively, that's really, really bad. Nemanja Bialica. Okay, great. Add it to the list. If you want your son to be an NBA center, give him here's the here's the mother load of it. Double ends? It's not a lot of double ends in the NBA. You got Nerlis Noel. If you want your son to be an NBA star or player, Give him an in first name. He's going to be seven feet tall. Jalen Noel is a must. He plays for the Orlando Magic. That's going to be easy. I'm trade finding a lot of these other people because at this point, I'm already kind of giving up the idea of us winning it all. I just wanted to get, um, I wanted to get Jokic and we got that. The 76ers have, um, who are we thinking about? Have uh, Nicholas Patu, right? Nicholas Patu. Shuma Okiki, you can go to your next squad. As of right now, if we're going strictly on end names, Jalen Noel, we need a point guard, bro. Jalen Noel's backup position is a point guard, but we ain't had no point guards. We gonna f give Kendrick Nunn or Frank Nilakina to run our team? How Neto to run our team? That lets, yeah, that's less you know. Let me let me let me rust this one because this don't feel like a championship team at all. All right, y'all. So we got the, the roster done. Kendrick Nunn. Ooh, roster done. Kendrick Nunn. We got Norm Powell, David Nwaba, Jokic, Nikola Vucevic. We got Nemanja Bialica, Nerlens Noel. Nicholas Batu, Jalen Noel. Wait, Nerlens Noel and Noel. I, I never literally did. I never. Larry Nance, Nick Richards, George Niang, and Abdul Nadar. This is a 50 win team. 
but it's not a championship team. Uh, like I said, wait, Steph Curry averaged 45? No chain settings, normal vanilla 2K22. He averaged 45? That's actually insane. All right. Uh, Steve Nash. Oh, we should have hired Steve Nash. Oh, we should have got our whole coaching staff with the end. All right, whatever. Um, Jokic is on the second team. We were the number one seed, so that's interesting. If we win this championship with the end roster being this, oh, my God. I, somebody deserve a raise. Not me. Jokic. Jokic deserves a race. All right, so we're going against the Warriors in the first round. Whose best players? Anthony Edwards slash Jalen Brown tied. Or not tied. Jalen Brown slightly better. Javante Green's on the team. That's the person I'm worried about. But I'm not worried too much because we're getting out of there in five. Next, we have the Minnesota Timberwolves who have Luka and Cade who just won Rookie of the Year. And they also have Jonas Valanciunas, Jetty Osmond, Jay Crowder. It's a good roster. Game one is a win. Game two is a win. Are we legitimately about to win with this end roster? We are... Eight games away. I had to think about it. Eight, but we're going against Mr. 45 points per game in a regular. Matter of fact, let's go look at Steph. 61? Let's go look at his season high. For him to average 45, I'm going to go out and let me say his season high was 77. Seven. It was 70. 70. For, he'd just be attempt, regularly attempting 41 shots. 70. All right. We he, They're the seven seed. None of that matters. Steph Curry who? Oh. Steph Curry who? Steph Curry who? We are in the finals to go against, oh, Giannis, Clint Capella, oh, Gianna, Nobi, Pat Bev, and Alfred Payton. Okay. Alfred Payton being their starting point guard and Pat Bev being their starting shooting guard is promising for me because that means that I, I think that we, we can win this. The end teams. The last name end teams. I thought this was about to take four to five spins. I'm just double checking my work just to make sure we didn't accidentally... Okay, I even signed somebody free agency. Bro gets no PTs. A 67 overall. I signed him just to make sure. Okay. Game one. Brooklyn Nets. Giannis and company win game one. He had a good game. Game two. Game two. Yes. Game three. No. Game four. Yes. Game five. Yes. Game six. Yeah, we just did it in the first year? In the first year. This is why I gave up every asset imaginable for that man because he is just different he is just different I, I like I, I know this one looks suspicious y'all i know it looks suspicious but these are the same settings we always play on in this game Jokic is just that different and him and vucevic vucevic just went all the way to the finals our start we had one world regal point guard and his name was kendrick nunn Norman Powell, Jalen Noel. And it's weird that Powell and Noel don't rhyme even though they just miss, just change in one letter. I cannot believe we just won that championship. David Nawaba was our starting small forward. He averaged two points in the play. Wait, did he start? Let's just make sure. Okay, Nicholas Batum actually started. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. He only plays seven minutes per. Okay, never mind. Either way, it is insane that that team just won a championship. That was one of the craziest finishes of, of a video of 2K22. If you enjoyed it, be sure to leave it a like. Go to the KLT for a Q subreddit or leave it in the comment section. Different video ideas because I'm always scouring. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Peace.